Hey everybody, welcome back to Pokemon Black Randomized. Uh, my name is Hatched Generation, Hatched, Colin, whatever you want to call me. It's been a while since I've actually recorded. It is winter now, so a season has passed. It is a month later, uh, which means we could get some items. I mean, metal coats, hopefully. Guys, guys, please, I need, I need to get the metal coat. I need to get the metal coat. Watch this be the metal coat. It was a moonstone. At least it was an evolutionary item. Oh, I could go down here too. Dang it. That would have been cool if that was a metal coat. Because then I could be like, oh, just kidding, guys. I meant this one. All right. Uh, I think there's another item that we could get in this city, right? Oh, standing on it. Well. Oh, there's another one? Oh, God. Come on. There's four items. Oh, there's another one? What? Why is there so many items over here? Oh, at least it was steel. It was close. Is that it? I didn't know there's so many items over here. Oh, we could go into this house. What's in here? Are you guys okay? Have you been, have you guys been trapped in here all like year? My dad used to have a cool job in a faraway region. Oh, really? Is that true? Oh, member Team Rocket, I was a long time gone. <laughs> oh my god. But Team Rocket, bye bye, go go. I met my re I I wait wait what? But Team Rocket, bye bye, a go go. I my region went home. Make new Team Rocket. I did, so myself I pledged, but now I married Am. Now for Team Rocket, there is no time by me, but happy family is big hooray. Somebody needs to get this guy an education. Welcome. Hey, I have a lot of souvenirs that my sweetie's old co-worker gave me. I don't mind giving you one. Is that an old coat? Ah, uh, he was in the Jodo, you know, uh, branch of Team Rocket. All right. Well, now we know there's a felon living here. But he's an outcast, all right? His house is separated from the rest of uh, society. He can't be a trouble to anybody except for three months out of the year. So I guess he's good. All right, I think that's all the items here. But there is some items we could go to that we've uh, passed before. What is this place? Is this Twist Mountain? I don't remember. Are you Twist Mountain? Oh, perfect. I was like, I need to go to Twist Mountain, but I need to pull up my Farfetch to fly. But I don't. Because I'm ready here. So it works out. I also don't have a rappel going. But I haven't encountered anything. Well, let's get a rappel going. Alright. So let's see if we can find a metal coat here. I found some honey. A focus sash. <laughs> Alright. We're going to go crack that open here in a bit. Alright. I'm going to have to fight this guy. Want to go? So it's good to train Pokemon nature like this. I accidentally skipped the first part of your dialogue, so I'm just gonna agree. Yes. Cause you're gonna train up Anita for me. I've been having her fight Lombres and Snovers, but not Lucario's, because Lucario has Bone Rush. So it, fighting a trainer's gonna be really helpful because it's been she's not easy to grind up. She doesn't get much experience from the Lombres and the Snovers. That confusion is unfortunate. Anita, why are you confused? Don't be a confused. Anita, I just, I said a thing. That means you got to respect it because I'm your trainer. You got to do what I got to say or something like that. I don't know. Sorry if I, I just realized I haven't recorded in so long. I feel like I'm out of it. Like I forgot I'm supposed to be talking all the time and like cracking jokes. Like who am I? Get it? Who am I? There's a knocked owl. I, I said, who am I? Oh my god, I'm funny. I am so fucking funny. Why Why am I not viral on YouTube? Does anybody say viral on YouTube anymore? Probably not. This isn't 2011. Nothing goes viral anymore. It's trending. Why, ain't I, why am I not trending on YouTube? Why am I so old? Why am I dying? I'm 26 when this video comes out. Alright, Tepig. I will, I'm actually going to switch train. Look at the tab peg. Think about it and then you'll get some experience from it. Uh, switch to snow cone. Alright, piggy. Oh wow, you got a flamethrower. Cool, no burn. Just get the surf off. Drown the piggy. We're going to hear you squealing in the water. That was like nothing. Uh, Cheruby, I'll swap back to Anita just so she could look at it and then I'll swap her out. 
and then actually kill it with something else. <clears throat> Anyways, uh, it is December when I'm recording this. December 2020. The year is finally coming to a close. I don't know if I'm going to be able to finish this entire Nuzlocke before 2021. I think I, I, I could probably beat the Pokemon League for sure, but I, I'm going to probably end up fighting it again to actually fight Alder the Champion. So that might have to happen like in January or something. Uh, repels effect war off. Can't have that happening. Why does it? Oh, it's because I keep getting items. So it keeps moving the bag by one. All right. So there should be a 100% item right here. Kine uh, kinesis. Cool. Don't uh, don't put Kadabra on a Pokemon card because he'll get banned. But then years later, the magician that got him banned will be like, hey, just kidding. Why do you wait so long? I don't know. I really, I don't know. There's nothing else over here except this guy. Get out of the way, fuck. I've been through here, so I think that's I think that's everything. Like unless there's another like maybe I haven't been in here. My face is just I'm scratching my face. I'm pretty sure I have been in here though. I've been I've been everywhere. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I've been everywhere. All right, well we will get out of here, and then I'll go get the far-fetched and fly to the fossil place there we go got the words out took a while but i got them out hey guys they're like it's been a month why aren't you doing anything hey let's see what we got a cocoon wait have we done this one i don't remember um Oh my gosh, his name's going to be Cadence, because that's the name that came to mind. I'm, I'm definitely not going to be using it. I would have to lose a lot of Pokemon before I resort to a Kakuna, <laughs> just just being honest. I should probably show the summary for him. There we go. <laughs> that's all we need to know. We actually didn't have a Kakuna. I don't know why I thought I did. It sounds so familiar. Definitely did not have a Kakuna, but now we do. We got one now. We're set. Let's let's continue my journey. I like to they call it the tube line bridge. I like to call it the waste time bridge because it really wastes a lot of time. It's just why is it so long? <laughs> That's what she said. Um Editor, cut that joke out, please. <laughs> it was stupid. But leave the leave the owl one in. That one was hilarious. Alright, so we completed everything on this route. Thank you. This is where Meatball died. I'm going to go on this way. If there's a town immediately right here in a Pokemon Center, then I wasted time. Munch Munch, I heard that a guy with a legendary Pokemon was visiting a Pellucid City. Munch Munch. I don't remember if I crossed this port. Oh, wow. Okay, so the reason I didn't come this far when I was doing grindy, whenever I had to heal, I had to run all the way back to Icarus City to heal because I didn't want to come over here and trigger a cutscene, which I'm about to do. Hello, Hatlin, this way. Can we just tackle him right now? Gets us, what a liar. Desperately trying to con everyone with a speech. Too true to American politics. That's correct, our Lord N has combined his power with the legendary dragon type Pokemon and intends to create a new world. We herald the return of the hero of Unova, founder of this region. Pokemon are different from people. They are living beings who contain unknown potential. Oh, let me get my Getz's voice. Sorry, I was drinking Sprite. So, uh, they are living beings from who we humans have much to learn. They are beings whose greatness we should acknowledge. Beings who should be freed from our oppression. We, Team Plasma, invite you to join us. We all want to create a new world where people and Pokemon are both free, ladies and gentlemen. I ask you now, please release your Pokemon, and so I end my plea to you today. Thank you one and all for your attention. <laughs> what a stupid formation. 
Is it true? Have we been making Pokemon suffer? Hmm, maybe we should release our Pokemon like Team Plasma says. No way, without Pokemon I'll be lonely and sad. Okay, somebody get that guy a friend. Please, somebody hang out with him. What was that about? That speech was off the charts strange. The corporation of people and Pokemon is how Unova came to exist to begin with. If a Pokemon really didn't want anything to do with humans, it would simply leave. Capturing a Pokemon in a Pokeball doesn't mean you've captured its heart. I didn't say that. <laughs> Let's go, Hatlin. Hey. Oh, uh, <clears throat> it's been a while, Iris and Raiden. Oh, Mr. Alder and the guy who hopped out that time. What's wrong? What does the wandering champion who left the Pokemon League need from us? Briefly, my request is this. Tell us about the legendary dragon type Pokemon. Are you talking about Zacrom or Reshiram? Dude, I kicked both of their asses. I don't care. <laughs> Moments ago, a troublemaker known as Getsus was here. He said a trainer named N has reawakened Zacrom. Yes, that trainer called N apparently told Hatlin here to search for the other dragon type Pokemon. Let me check what I have straight this end or what you presume to set the two dragon types and they want to fight. Wow, dragon types are supposed to get along. Uh, let's, let's go defeat N and whatnot. Hatlin, I'll wait your rival. Oh, excuse me. Farewell, I'm counting you, Dra Dragon and Iris. Yeah, I was like, I don't need to know this. I know what's going on. Oh, he's gone. Is he okay? He looked kind of scary. Don't worry, Iris. He is the strongest trainer in all of Unova. Well, Helen, is it? Come to my home. As Alder asks, I'll tell you everything I can about the legendary dragon type Pokemon. Iris shall please show the way. Why does she know where you live? Just kidding. You bet. If it's a Plisid City, I can take you anywhere. As for the story of Zekrom Reshiram, we'll tell you all we know about it this way. Look at that emo kid. He's probably playing a cover of Pierce with a Veil song. Our hopes are put into this melody. I will send them to the future. All right, where are we going? Just a little further. Man, most gym leaders don't have houses. This is it. Is this actually his house? Yeah, he just Drayden's house. He's such a big deal, he gets his own house. What a weird house. I'll explain. What you are holding is the Lightstone. Rashiram, who will likely awaken from the Lightstone, and Zekrom, who's already awake, were once the same Pokemon. That single dragon Pokemon, along with the twin heroes, brought a new region into being, and people and Pokemon had happy lives. One day, however, the twin heroes, the older brother who sought the truth and the younger brother who sought ideals, began to argue about how to decide which one of them was right. The single dragon type Pokemon that had been with them all that time split its body into two. One sided with the older brother and the other with the younger brother. In its pursuit of ideals, the black dragon type Pokemon- You can't just call it black, what the hell is wrong with you? What the hell is wrong in this game? <laughs> its name was Zekrom, and the other, the white dragon- Whoa, you can't say that! He's Caucasian! His name was Reshiram. That does sound like a white person name. Drayden is my name because the two of them were once the same entity. Their battle raged endlessly, and neither one could be declared the winner. They simply exhausted themselves. The twin heroes proclaimed that there was no one side that was right and seized the conflict. But but the two heroes battled again, and in an instant later, Zekrom and Reshiram destroyed a Unova of lightning and fire. Then they disappeared. But but if people work with Pokemon in the right way, we don't have to worry anymore about the world being destroyed. I'm getting bored of talking to you. Me too. Hey, you need to fight my gym. I made a promise to Alder. You must win the gym badge on the Oplicit City gym. Helen, I'll be waiting for your challenge at the Pokemon gym. That's cool, man. I'm going to go upstairs in your bedroom. What the fuck? Drayden has roommates? I have an item that I don't know how to use. Would you like to give it a try and see if you can make it work? Yes. You may be a master. Here it is. A ring target. If a Pokemon holds a ring target, it can be hit even by a move that would usually have no effect. For example, a normal type uh, move would hit a ghost type Pokemon. Interesting. What's up, Mr. Football? Concerned about your Pokemon's weight? You don't need to put it on the dot. Just let hold this. No, oh, thanks. The weight of Pokemon holding a Flood Stone will be halved. That way, you can reduce the damage caused by weight based moves such as Low Kick and Grass Knot. What about you? I have coaching Iris. Well, honestly, she's been stronger than me ever since she came here. You have a weird voice. <laughs> I don't know. I was like, I need to give this guy something unique. Um. All right, let's go do the gym. That'll be my goal for this episode. Dang it, this would have been the best spot to find a Melico. 
Your Laron looks like it can try a little harder. Oh. <laughs> Why would you say that? Why would you say that to Anita? What'd she do? Hey. Oh. <laughs> I didn't know we were going to fight. I just wanted I just want to have a chat with the guy upstairs and know we're going straight into a battle. All right. Unfortunately, I need, I didn't move my party around a bit, so let's see what we got. Um I have Rono. Yeah, I have Rono. Rono is going to destroy. So literally just fight uh this way. Rono just use the X scissor. It'll literally kill any of these three Pokémon. All three of these Pokemon are going to be weak to x Scissor. What you got, Shroomish? What you got? Oh, I didn't mean to use Pursuit. Why did it move my move back? Great, now I got hit by Worry Seed. Oh, no, now, now I can't sleep. Sorry, Shroomish, you're supposed to die a turn ago. Glade is... Glade might resist x Scissor actually, but it shouldn't be able to hurt me that much, so I'm not worried about it. Yeah, you should have just tried to get a attack in. Maybe a crit psychic would have killed me, you know? But you went for the swords dance, and that's, that's your mistake. That's your mistake. Good job, Anita. You're level 39. Almost caught up to the team. Be ready, stay prepared so you can, yeah. I, th I think I'll keep this team for the battle downstairs. The flow of a game changes every turn. Rotation battle, can you master it? I already have. I think we did lose one Pokemon to a rotation battle before. But. I'm not worried. Miss Magius. Oh. Cobalion. Cobalion is steel and fighting, right? Um, Anita, you need to move out of the way. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go back into Roanoa. The Cobalion is scary. Honestly, I should probably use Pursuit right there. Yeah, I'll do, I'll do Pursuit. I should have assumed it would, it would swap. Justified? What does that do? Oh my god. That is terrifying. That is absolutely terrifying. Okay, it didn't go up again, but this iron head's gonna hurt. Oh, it didn't hurt that bad. Can you please swap? Thank you. I'll probably try to take out these other Pokemon. And then I'll probably switch to Maror. I at least want to get rid of Miss Magius. But I'll switch to Maroar for the... I just realized that Mareep is an electric type. And Scyther is a flying type. I messed up bad. Oh my god. It went for a stupid cotton guard. You stupid sheep. You stupid fucking sheep. You could have ended You could have ended my Nuzlocke right there. Because I would rage quit if Renault died. Oh, what am I doing? Uh, let's go ahead and uh, go back this way. Oh yeah, Volt Tackle. Let's do Action Sensory. Perfect. Gonna get a super effective hit. Yeah, that hurts. That hurts. I feel like Marora should take it better, but because its attack is boosted. I don't want to use Volt Tackle. Why does it move my move back to the first slot? That is so dumb. Ah, oh, I'm gonna have to heal. That was overkill. That was absolutely overkill. I didn't do as much recoil as I thought it would. Rono's 44. Alright. We'll be fine. Uh, I'm just going to keep going out and fix the sensories. It's probably going to take two more to take down uh, that Cobalion. What's up, Cobalion? Oh, see, that time I didn't go back to Volt Tackle. I was just spamming A again. Nice. What are you learning? What are you learning, buddy? Future Sight? You learning Future Sight? I'm okay with what we got, honestly. We'll get. That's not. Keep old moves. Give up on Future Sight. 
Sorry, Bob. It's just the way the battle rotates, and I'm gonna go heal. All right, time to go take on the gym, the final gym of the Nuzlocke. I'm excited. This gym's cool, by the way. Welcome to the Pellucid City Gym, the Unova region's strongest and biggest trial. First off, please take this fresh water. Stay hydrated, gamer. I'll drink water right now. You know, I just took a drink. I'll take another one. Let me give you a brief explanation. The path around this gym is shaped like two dragons. The path changes when you step on the switches. Pay attention to the dragons. Thank you. Is this a switch? No, just a weird little circle? Cool. Hey. The Dragon Gym in a Pellucid City is where tough trainers show they can carve out their own path. Wow, that's totally cool, man. I'm gonna kick your ass. <laughs> I do have Anita up front. She's not the strongest, but uh, she really needs experience. So her taking down the Zapdos is gonna be very helpful. Especially since we have Spark, although that pressure sucks. We should take it fine. Okay, I thought I thought I would do less, but we still took it. We still took it. As long as we do more than it did to us. Sorry. What? Alright, big bird. I'm going to have to find someone else to deal with you. I don't really have a good counter. Meatball is the electric flying counter. Sorry, I'm burping because of the... Because of the water. Um. So, what are you weak to? You're weak to... Rock? Ice? Things I don't have. I guess I guess I'll go into Kirby. I hate that I got the stat boost from that ancient power though. Alright, yeah, so far this gym's pretty tough. Not the actual gym leader, but this one trainer with the Zapdos. Who's getting the stat boost? Kinda tough. I'm gonna have to go with Metronome. Hope I get something cool. You used Detect. Oh, I thought that's an explosion. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, the stab pluck is going to hurt. Oof, don't get a recoil move, please. I think that's a recoil move. Is it not? That's a critical hit. Oh, it wasn't. Cool, that was actually really good. Um, Here, drink some water. Probably should have given you more. Bigger HP item. Okay, yeah. Let's let's do a hyper potion or a full restore. You know, let's. Add, I'm glad I didn't give you like a lemonade, because you'd probably be dead. I think lemonade does less than water. All right, how many plucks can we take? I think that's the mid max damage. I think that was max. I think before was mid. I actually probably can't. I probably need to swap out here. That ancient power really boosted, really boosted that uh that pluck. Ah, uh, doing some math. So I did like did like fifty seven damage, but it could do like it could do like sixty. I think we could take one pluck. I think we could take one. I think. I'm not gonna risk it. No, we we have Maror. We have Maror. Maror could take hits. He's the tank. Let's not be stupid. I'm not gonna be stupid this late in the Nuzlocke. It went for detect. All right. It's fine with me. Hey, can I borrow you for this time machine this guy wants to use? Alright, doesn't do as much as I would like it to do. I feel like Detect sh should not be able to block certain moves, like Extra Sentry. Like, how do you block? How do you block that? <laughs> like, I don't understand. Oh, you're being annoying. This Zapdos is probably, like, the most cracked Pokemon I've fought this entire Nuzlocke. Like, I've had some, I've had a couple of challenging battles, I guess. But this one's pretty good. This one, this Zapdos put up a fight. Turns out Zapdos is a good counter to my team. I'm gonna go heal after that. Jeez. Alright, so let's hit the switch. Oh, that's not a switch? Okay. 
Never mind. I don't know what the switches look like yet, apparently. All right. So, yeah, we get to climb up these giant dragon statues, which is pretty cool. Um, Got to go this way. What's over here? Are these not switches? They look like they should be switches. Or maybe they're pressed down already. I don't know. I will tell a trainer who beats me how to move forward in this gym. Okay, cool. Please. Thank you. That's really nice of you. I'm going to kick your Pokemon's ass, though. I'm much like, I was, I was, that'd be funny if coincidentally there was like three trainers and each one had like a Zapdos, Articuno, and a Moltres. The odds of that are super, super low. But uh, still, would have been cool. Uh, I'm just going to go with the Iron Head. So probably another Iron Head and a Spark combo. Oh, we got the flinch. Hell yeah. Sorry, Munchlax. Sorry to be this one. I was so happy when Munchlax was released. It was first in Pokemon XD Gale Darkness. I was so ha I wanted it so bad in that game too. I don't think you get to use it. I think it just steals your food. Uh, Metal Sound. That, gets, that lowers defense, right? That could be really useful. Honestly... Yeah, I don't think I need to bulk. I don't think there's too many scenarios I'll try to bulk up. But there could be scenarios where I might want to lower the special defense of a Pokemon and swap out. Especially since a Needle in in theory should be able to take some hits after it evolves. So oh, I didn't ask her how to. Oh, it doesn't matter. I figured it out. All right, I went the wrong way and accidentally hit the switch again. But now I know I need to go this way. <laughs> hey, fight me! Do you understand how the dragon's heads move? I mean, I know if I press buttons, they move, but honestly, that's some really good animatronics, not gonna lie. They got Five Nights at Freddy's beat. Um, Oddish. I'm still part rock type, right? Like, I don't want to stay in for this. No, uh, who needs experience? I guess I'll go into Kirby. Kirby and Snow Cone are dragging a little bit behind. But that's okay, because I'm sure all my... That was rude. That was really rude. I'm sure by the time I hit the Pokemon League, uh, I'll have everybody evened out level-wise. Protecting yourself from critical hits? That's fine. I don't need critical hits to kill you, Oddish. There you go. Kirby catching up again. And a Vigoroth. Oh, I have to sneeze. <coughs> yeah. Ugh. Oh man, I don't have any. I'm gonna have to use a dirty napkin, which I think I use often in videos when I sneeze. Oh, uh, I don't know what was in this one. It was probably a sneeze as well. So, it's fine. Um, I swapped over here just to switch. Actually, you could probably take a Vigor off. I don't think it adds anything too crazy. I guess a slash critical hit would hurt. Oh, actually, probably not. I am made of iron. You cannot. You can't slash me. It'll hurt you. I'm just filing your nails down. Is that necessary? Like, you know you're not going to win this. Like, you know you're not going to win this, alright? You're just being annoying. You did like 20 damage in like 4 hits. It's pathetic. Not even. I gave you the benefit of saying 20. You didn't even hit 20. Oh, now my nose is all... My, like, my boogies are all, like, loose in my nose now. And I feel like I got the snifflies. How annoying. Are you happy just hanging out with Pokemon? Or do they have to be strong? We'll see which type you are. Honestly, like, if I had Pokemon in real life... I mean, I kind of do in Pokemon Go, I guess. But, like... I'm sure I would enjoy having Pokemon that both make me happy and make me str or and are strong. Like I don't have to have a Pokemon that makes me happy and strong. I could have both, or I guess I don't know. I'm sure all of them would make me happy, but not all of them would need to be strong. Um, this is a swap out for sure. I need to go blow my nose. I'll be back. All right, I'm back. I'm gonna hit this thing with a surf. While I drink some water. Easy. There's no other outcome. <sighs> drown, camel, drown. Sorry, Daniel. 
or Danielle, I guess. I don't know. The naming conventions in this region are weird, huh? Oh, they're both black dragons. Okay. Are they white dragons in Pokemon White? I don't remember. I just assumed they're both. There's one black, one white. Okay, so that's not the way, so I gotta go back this way. Hi. Thanks for coming, I happily welcome you, but I may be a little rough on you. Oh, the first guy had a Zapdos? It's gonna be hard to top that, I think. Unlikely anybody will top that. A Carnivine? Yeah, I will have to swap Anita out again. But, like, this Carnivine's not gonna do much to my team. I already know. It's part Poison type, right? If it's part poison type, I could go into more roar. It might have bite or crunch, which actually could be detrimental. Stockpile, that's the second Pokemon in this gym that's using stockpile. Carnivine is so cool. I've never had one. I really want one. One of these Nuzlocks will have Carnivine. Like, eventually. I, I think I'll be doing Nuzlocks for, like, ever on the channel. So, like, eventually I'm bound to get a Carnivine, right? I need to download like a lot of ROM hacks just in case and like Nintendo ever takes any down so I just have them. I just, I, I've downloaded every single like vanilla ROM. But I need to download like a lot of ROM hacks. Alright, one more extra sensory. Ooh. Okay. I thought, I thought it hurt more. I think the stockpile might have done more, surprisingly. Good job, Anita. You're pretty much caught up level-wise. Alright, so he blocks the tail. And then I gotta jump on this one. Alright, looks like I'm not done yet, though. Hi. I will test you to see how well you really know Pokemon. Okay. Oh, Volcarona, huh? It's a pseudo legendary, right? Volcarona? It's at least, like, really rare. I'm going to Snow Cone. It's Fire and Bug. I don't think it'll have anything too scary on it. See, that's not scary, it's just annoying, so that's fine. Surf should be oh I don't know if Surf will win it, KO. It might take two Surfs. Yeah, that's kind of what I figured. Alright, so we're going to be in the red. After the fire spin. We could swap out a fire spin though, right? I think we can. I'll only stay in if I need to. Needle King? Ah. I don't need to. I could go into Shiozaki, I guess. It's just kind of a risk. Because it's a poison type. Right? It's poison and ground. Ah, oh, what a classic cry. Um, so let's do Mega Drain. What a cool Pokemon. I feel like Nido King's underrated, honestly. Unless you're playing, like, uh, Kanto, any of the Kanto games, then it's just, like, a staple, I feel like. I'm just gonna keep Mega Draining. So any damage it does to me, I get it back, and it's about to get confused. So really, I just need to hit itself once, and I think we should be okay. Nope, still thrashing, okay. Yeah, I was more worried if it had like, I don't know, like poison jab or something. I don't really know what Needle King learns nowadays. It did hit itself though. Level 43. Come on and slam, and welcome to the 
I feel like slime would be a good move to have. Like an actual like vanilla move on Shizaki. But I feel like poison powder is still so useful and growth could be even more useful. I could really boost my drains. Uh, let's put poison powder to rest. Let's learn slam. Alright, Porygon. I'll switch to Anita. I don't think I'm going to be able to do the gym leader this episode. I'm already way over time. I don't want to have super long episodes. Because no one's going to watch them. Um, Iron Head. And another Iron Head. I still think it's messed up that Porygon is banned from being like in the anime. <laughs> because like it didn't even cause those seizures. It was Pikachu, man. Alright. Um, I'll go down. And I think this is the last button. Probably not. Oh no, we got another. There's so many trainers in this gym. God, I thought there would be like three or four trainers and then the gym leader. But no, there's a lot more. Is this the right way? I don't know, man. This doesn't feel right. So she's the last trainer, right? Cool. This will be the last battle of the episode. I wonder what you, you um, hmm. <laughs> yeah. I wonder what I'll do. Two Pokemon. Lugia, why? There's so many Pokemon to choose from. Why do you gotta choose this one? Alright, swap out. Let's go into, ah, oh, Marora would be perfect. Well, I'm actually, I should, kind of wish I healed a little bit. You're, you're steel and rock. Can you take like a water type attack? I, you might be able to. Oh, here's what I'll do actually. I will heal Anita, and then I'll heal Maror, who I want to switch into. Oh, you do. You did go for Hydro Pump. I'm glad I healed. Not that it mattered, but I'm glad I healed. At least I was kind of being smart about it. Ah, oh, gotta grind up another Pokemon. Great. Great. You killed Anita. You killed her. That was that was uncalled for. She was she was baby. She was baby. She wasn't even an Aggron yet. And you killed her. I'm gonna volt tackle you so hard after I drink this hyper potion. Oh great, now you're gonna boost your hydro pump. Nope, dumb of items. Just Volt Tackling. Should be a one hit KO. Alright, maybe not. Now I'm gonna have to heal again. I'm just gonna keep healing Volt Tackling. And hope it doesn't get like a crit Hydro Pump or something. All right, so we should kill this Lugia on this hit. We should, right? We took it to yellow in one hit. Yeah, cool. And we got a critical anyway, so we're good. I forgot the recoil was going to happen anyways, but we're good. We're good. Everything turned out fine in that scenario. What didn't turn out fine was Anita. I had a feeling she wouldn't last. But I thought she'd make it to the Pokemon League at least. Alright, Drillbur. Um just gonna mega drain you. And then the video. Thank you guys for watching. Um no metal coats. We defeat all these gym trainers. Anita didn't make it. Actually, I, s I gotta close out this on the PC. Never mind, I can't even end the video yet. Cool. Thanks, Scott. Motherfucker. Alright, to save time, I'm gonna cut out what happened that gym i tried to go back but i couldn't so i figured fuck i have to go fight that trainer at the very end so i was doing the switches to go back and it turns out there was actually a certain switch path that would take me to the end of the gym and so i actually managed to escape 
Um, let's go and swap to heaven. Grab us. Grab Anita. Anita. I didn't know it would have hydro pump, and I thought even if in some weird case it did, you would survive hydro pump. My bad. My fault. Take full responsibility for that one. Now for your replacement. I really want Torkoal, but it's going to be so hard to level up. Axagadrill is a good one. Erdan, what the, what, what the fuck kind of name did I give you? I'm sorry I gave you that name. I guess we'll take Erdan. Cool. Thank you guys for watching. I gotta go level up Erdan. Uh, keep on cracking, I guess.